the ever-transforming Addis Ababa streets. The city has been witnessing new roads and skyscraper buildings since recent times. But above all, it is these buildings which are changing the lives of the common citizen in Ethiopia, the condominium housing buildings. Over the last five years, the government-sponsored housing development project built more than 109,000 housing units and forwarded for the public in cheap prices in a draw system. Mainly, uh, the cost of the houses is cheaper because the government gives land freely. There is no cost for land because land is a government and uh, people's uh, property. So those who cannot lease land, who cannot get land by lease, could get land freely through this condominium project. Residents who have registered and saved to pay the startup money needed to own these condos now are enjoying living in these houses. More than a million families have now benefited from the project. Our former life as tenants was a nightmare. But today, when I see life in the condominiums, it's transforming from what was a backward life to a modern one. The change in our lives is simply amazing. These houses are suitable for young citizens like me. Secondly, it's a big deal for us to start living in a modern house than what we used to have, which was a mad house. Even the rent fee is not that high. The construction project of building thousands of housing units in Ethiopia has continued and currently there are more than 200,000 houses under construction. But this mega project has its own mega challenges. The people need the house, but the construction pace lags behind because there are different problems in our country. There is the infrastructure problem, there is uh, uh, this resource uh, material supply problem, and uh, even we, sometimes the construction sector's capacity is very low. The Ethiopian housing construction is known for the job opportunities it creates for citizens. 40 to 50,000 new jobs have been created for the locals annually since 2006. The construction boom in Ethiopia is seen in different sectors also. Currently, there are more than four hydroelectric power generating dam constructions going on, including the massive Grand Renaissance Dam being built over the Nile. The active construction scene is also a sign of the ever motivated. Ethiopian economy. Grumjala CCTV at the Ethiopia.